Sorry about the awful quality. Capture cards for the PlayStation 3 are pretty damn expensive, so I'll have to suck up for this for now. But I've broken Ratchet and Clank 3. Oh my god, this is absolutely crazy. Seriously, you guys will probably laugh how broken this game is. It is unbelievable. This is the first time it's ever happened to me with this specific game. But it is it's just stupid what's happened to this game. I'm not using any mods or anything. But oh boy. This is just absolutely Stupid. Now, I normally wouldn't show um, footage of a PS3 game because I can't, I can't capture uh, what's going on. But this, this is next level glitches, and oh boy, this is just, this is just ridiculous. So this is the save. Now this save isn't corrupted. But it's completely effed up. You'll wait and see till you see it. It is absolutely stupid. I have no idea what's going on. No idea. I don't even know what caused this. It's, I was just playing the game normally. And then my vendor started being weird. Alright. Paradox error. <laughs> Ammo 10 out of 55,374. Um, yeah, 47. This weapon's completely glitched. It's not working. This is supposed to be the sub cannon, and. It's not working, great. Uh, Plasma Whip is in minus experience, because why not? Um. And I don't know how I got this weapon. What is, is this the bomb glove? Yep, it's the bomb glove. Yeah, look, yo, Bungalow from Ratchet and Clank 2. This is the Plasma Whip. That always appears, that weird thing at the bottom of the screen now. Yeah, this is literally the Bungalow. It does literally no damage. Yep, 40 shots, barely did anything. Well, even let me select that weapon anymore. If I want to purchase ammo for every weapon, it is going to cost me a whooping. You know, I'm not even going to attempt to say that number. And it's in minus two. Uh, this crashes the game if I try and purchase this. And I don't know what that's for. Okay. If you select that, it does this. I, I don't get this game. I don't get it. What's, what's going on? <laughs> I don't get it.
Yeah, this seems absolutely jacked, is it? <laughs> oh my god. Well, I completely broke the game. I've got a weapon from the previous game, somehow. Don't know why. Um, I've got this weird ammo thing, which does not fulfill any weapon at all. Huh. Oh well, I think that's about it I can show. Um, I suppose this glitch might have been useful if I encountered it a bit earlier in the game. I mean that bomb glove does a decent amount of damage for, um, for a glitchy weapon. Even though it only has 40 shots, period. Um. Yeah, I think I'm going to end this video here now. Um, hope the next video hopefully will not be a glitch test point from one particular game on the PlayStation 3. Yeah. This is just... That's my PS3 crash. No, the PS3 hasn't crashed, <laughs> luckily. Um, yeah, that's about it. Anyway, guys, if you ever figure out how, uh, how, what triggered this horrendous glitch, I'll let you know. So hopefully you can avoid it, because Unless you obviously want your sub cannon to be glitched in return for a glitchy bomb glove weapon that only has 40 shots, period. God, that was weird, that glitch. <laughs> but, yeah. What can I say? Anyway. I'll see you in the next video, I guess. It'll probably be Skylanders related, but... Alright. Oh, and the next video won't be this quality. It'll probably be on the PlayStation 4. Uh, unless, of course, you guys don't mind. If that is the case, then I might do this for the PS3, uh, Spires Adventure. I don't know. I just wanted to show off the this, this stupid thing that happened. I suppose since it's recording off a TV, you can tell it's real, and it photoshopped or anything. But, yeah. Alright guys, I'll see you in the next video.